Hello everyone, this is our 17th Ship of Heroes video. We're combining a network test where we add a large number of characters to one of our mission maps with a stress test where we try to discover the limits of our current game build. Everything you're about to see was run on a high-end gaming desktop and set for maximum graphics with 1920 by 1080 resolution and shadows on. The first thing you see is four of our developers playing as Sword Blossom clones and standing on the crates. Then we begin to add more clones, each of which is logging into the game from an account as a player would. Twenty clones. They are programmed to move along specific paths. Forty clones. Sixty clones. Eighty clones. At this point, we had success, but we decided to keep going. One hundred clones. Let's take a stroll. Then, We'll push the envelope. Two hundred. That's a lot of clones. We're showing copies of a real, highly customized character, made in our own character creator with our own art assets. Let's see how far we can push it. 300. They're getting kind of bunched up out there. We're hoping these stress tests with 100, 200, and even 300 cloned characters will give the gaming community a sense of hope that a new MMO with larger raid capabilities is being developed in the Unreal Engine. Now for the grand finale of this set of tests. Simultaneous attack by 100 clones. We've made a lot of progress and there's more to come. Thanks for watching. We have more stuff coming out in December. So keep watching our website and YouTube channel.